Once there was a goddess who lived in the Garden of Eden. The land was barren and bare and void of life. The goddess, wanting to bring joy and colour and existence, took out half of her heart and planted it in the soil. Each day she watered it with her tears and fed it with her wisdom. She was a lonely goddess and longed for the other half of her heart to grow into a beautiful tree. Day by day she tended to her seed and slowly, slowly the seed yielded a tree. As time went by, the tree produced all kinds of fruits such as apples, pears, oranges and peaches. But the fruit that caught her eye was the pomegranate. She knew that this was the fruit for her and she wanted it so much. As she reached out to take it, it fell and hit the floor hard. The skin had split right open and there was juice everywhere. The goddess wept for the pomegranate. She wept and wept. She wept and wept so hard that she was heard by her grandfather who had been walking in the garden that day. Feeling compassion for his granddaughter, the chief god waved his hand over the juice of the pomegranate and a man was formed. His being grew until he was the same height as the goddess. And immediately, the goddess was magnetized to this new man, this man that had been created from a god. She reached out to hold his hand and placed upon his head a crown of gold and declared him king. She gave him all that she had, all that she owned. She taught him many things and he was the perfect student. After all, he already was half of her heart. The man was magnetized to the goddess but knew not why. He didn't know if he loved her. He didn't know if he was entranced by her energy or what he was feeling. He longed to be near her, to kiss her, to touch her, yet he still could not understand why. After many, many years, the man drew himself his own heart and the goddess's heart became whole again. One night, after all of his lessons had been taught to him by the goddess, he left silently, leaving beside his sleeping goddess the half of the heart that he no longer wanted.